It's enough to make your blood run cold. Nothing. Well, now. Study. Well, the delivery man's got a package for you. Uh, it's not another one of those strange chemistry experiments you've been trying, is it? No, ma'am. Good. I'll have him bring it up. Way. It's a clear day here above the Big Apple, just a few scattered clouds. Remember, folks, to always keep your eye on the road ahead. What in the blue blazes was that? What was that? Just a little traffic control problem, only to be expected when we're sitting like ducks in the middle of the busiest airspace in the world. Just keep us on course. I've got a plan. From this low altitude, there's no way they can escape the beam. Dimitri, how's the scan coming? As the humans say, I think we've just hit Haybert. Then let's start prospecting. Wow! This is a really cool jacket! Do all humans wear jackets like this? I've never seen one before. Uncle Bigfoot never lets me leave the village. So, I mailed myself to ya! When are we gonna fight the Darkstalkers, huh? huh? I wanna see some action! Uh, let's step outside where there's less to break. This is really great, Harry. You can see everywhere from here. Or at least... Ah! Careful! Can you just sit and be quiet? Felicia will be here any second, and we'll figure out what to do with you then, okay? Okay? Uh, Harry, is this normal? Hairball! Boy, but you're not Felicia. Hi, I'm Hairball. Are you Pyron? My Uncle Bigfoot says Pyron is a big bozo. Silence! Hmm, a slight change of plan. Welcome to your new home. Darkstalkers will return. And now, back to Darkstalkers. Whoa, this is so way cool! Be quiet, Hairball. Let me handle this. <clears throat> you better let us go. The others will be looking for us. Ah, these humans, they're so spunky, so tenacious. Of course they'll come looking for you. I'm rather counting on that. In fact, I'm going to let them know you're here. What? Don't you think this is so cool, Harry? Have you ever been on a spaceship before? I haven't. I... You've been quiet, Hairball. I've noticed that most creatures 
creatures are foolishly fond of their young and will do anything to protect them, even sacrifice themselves. I am expecting that this situation will be no different. When Bigfoot learns that I have his beloved nephew, he'll be happy to surrender himself. And while you have no value to me personally, I am sure that your protector does attach some foolish sentiment to your existence. Don't you agree, human? <laughs> Nothing to worry about your self-importance. The little mammal has activated the automatic stabilizer override and we are in imminent danger of crashing. Whoa! That was just like a roller coaster! Uh, of course, I've never been on a roller coaster, but if I had, I bet that's what one would feel like, don't you think? Why don't you go play in the airlock? Dimitri, Morgan, take that! Creature away and teach him some manners and lock the human up. I know how troublesome his species can be. With pleasure. Out! Well, that was exciting. Shall I take us back into orbit now or just ram a building? No! Stay low and take us to the Sasquatch village. Your wish is my command, Hornhead. This ship is really big. How does it stay up in the air, huh? Huh? Uh, if I told you that I'd never been on a spaceship before? Wow, this is so cool. Wait till Uncle Bigfoot finds out. Were you born with those fangs? How old are you? Yes, Anka Dimitri. Just how old are you? Old enough to know better? Old enough to kick your... Now, now. There are children present. Make yourself comfortable, human. I have plans for you. What are you gonna do? I think I might run some tests on his blood to discover just where his curious powers come from. Aren't you forgetting something? Pyron gave him to you after all. Come on! So what are we gonna do, huh? Huh? Can we play baseball? I played baseball before in Harry's house. It was a lot of fun. You have no choice, Sasquatch. As you can see, your nephew is in my care. If you do not deliver yourself to me in two hours, well, I refuse to be responsible for the consequences. Is this what TV is like? I've never seen TV before. Does it get any other channels? Can, can he see me? Hi, Uncle Bigfoot. How are you? Here I am. Hey, there's some pretty neat stuff on this ship. There's a really cool button over here. You should see what it does when I push it. I'm glad to see that you are well, Hairball. Your mother is very worried about you. If you harm one hair on his head, Pyron, it is I who will not be responsible for the consequences to you. Do you understand? Two hours to decide, Bigfoot. That's all. Be ready for the beat. Uh, take that flea-infested woolly mammal away. Who are you calling a mammal? I may be only a computer, but I have a bad feeling about this. Not good. You must be very worried. Of course, but my nephew won't make as easy a hostage as they think he will. Two hours? Round up the squat squad. We'll be ready for the beam, all right. And then Pyron will get even more than he's bargaining for. Come to start Demetrius' experiments for him, Morgan? Don't be a fool. I want you alive and well. Not a drained out husk. What are you saying? I'm saying I'm letting you go. I will have you as my pupil yet, but now is not the time. Go! Before I change my mind, head for the control room. That's where the beamer is. I'll keep Dimitri busy. I can't leave without Hairball. I wonder where they're keeping him. <laughs> Probably in a soundproofed room. Gotta 
get up to that ship and rescue Harry. But how? <laughs> I think I found my ticket to the stars. For my next number, let's really rattle some bones. Ew, what stinks worse in here? Your music or you? Oh, uh, Felicia, <laughs> you're spoiling my gig. <laughs> Your gig was pre spoiled. And I think you did that yourself, Raptor. Look, if you don't shut your yap, there's gonna be a whole lot of shaking going on. I don't think so, Bone Boy. <laughs> Fancy meeting you here. Fly me to the moon, babe. Getting captured isn't as easy as I thought it would be. Uh, especially if he keeps trying to kill me. Time to wrap this concert up. Hey! Beam me up, Scummy. So how'd you get to be a vampire? I've had enough of your impertinent questions! It's time to stop them once and for all! Do you think that's wise, fearless leader? I'm sure Pyron would be unhappy to have his collection damaged. I can't take his questions anymore! Oh, I can't believe the great Dimitri would ever get tired of talking about himself! No, but I'm plenty tired of you! <clears throat> I hate to interrupt your discussion, but I thought you'd like to know that your other prisoner, the human, has escaped. Escaped? If you had anything to do with this Morrigan, keep your eye on that animal. Make sure he doesn't get into any more trouble. I'll deal with you later. <laughs> it's been a hard day's night, and I've been lurking like a frog. No, I don't have time to listen to your babble. I've got to stop Dimitri. Watch him. Make sure he doesn't get into trouble. I'll be right back. <laughs> what am I then? A blooming babysitter? <laughs> There's something happening here, and what it is ain't very clear. But I'm gonna find out what it is. Uh, computer? Uh, watch the kid. Me? Hey, where'd everyone go? Now, young man, you are going to sit still and not say a word. <gasps> Do you run on batteries? Or are you plugged in somewhere? You got video games? I like video games. Of course, I never played video games, but if I did, I bet I would like them a lot. You got Space Invaders? Oh, that's my favorite. Well, as long as I don't mind singeing a little fur. Well, 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 what have we here? Looking for something? Or just trying to escape? Since there's no Morgan here to stop me, now might be a good time to see just what makes you so special. I'm a very good judge of a person's bloodlines, you know. Darkstalkers will return. And now, back to Darkstalkers. Stop! Don't interfere with me, Morrigan! I need him for an apprentice! You can have him after I'm through! Sorry, can't wait! I need a living human, not an empty shell! He's mine! Mine! Sorry, gang. Neither of you gets him. Run, Harry! Hey, is this where the action is? Wait for me! <laughs> <laughs> 
So, then when I was two, I ran away with a secret cage. Of course, I found out later that they weren't secret to anyone but me. Uncle Bigfoot knew where they were all the time. Boy, did I get in trouble. But Uncle Bigfoot, he was pretty cool. Can you leave here? Huh? Huh? Like, do you have feet or something? I have no need for feet, but I wish I had hands to throttle you with. <laughs> That's funny. Uncle Bigfoot says things like that, too. <laughs> That's it! I am not a nanny! Pyron can handle this himself! Computer? Computer! Hello! Cool. I wonder how this thing works. Come in, Unca Bigfoot! What's going on? I don't know. Follow it. Now's our chance. Go for it. Superfluousness? Would you please tell me what in the name of the Great Collector is going on? Isn't this all part of your plan? Computer! The human boy and the cat woman have escaped. Morgan and Dimitri are reducing your collection room to dust. No! And we're dangerously low in altitude and could crash at any moment. My collection! Those fools! Dimitri! Answer me or I'll have your head! Dimitri! Do you hear me? Stop this instant! I must not be as young as I used to be. I was never that young. Nowhere to run to, nowhere to hide. Oh, yeah? It's a singing sword! I saw one once on a cartoon! Great. Maybe later we can have a concert. <laughs> Music is my business! Stand back! Crap, you fool! No! You bring the whole place down! Indeed, and I bet on you. Pyrot, we've got them. Everything is under control. Uh, uh, under control? Under my collection! Plan still working perfectly, Mon General? You've got two minutes to bring the prisoners here to me. I want a full explanation of this! You heard him. Time to meet the Reaper. Not so fast, you evil bloodsucker! Let my people go! And just what do you think you're going to do, you hairy little yak? <sighs> Who's you gonna yak? Get him, boys! <laughs> My ship. Ready to admit you've got more than you can handle, Pyron? Never! My plan will not fail! Fisherman! Anakaris! Stop them! We're almost there! It's just around this! Oops! Run!
We'll never make it back to the Beamer. But how are we going to get off this ship? I think I got a way to make them want us off the ship. Follow me. Master, it just didn't work. I am aware of that. So now I have a new plan. Something constructive. Something to keep you busy and give you time to think. I want you to put it all back together again. Just the way it was. <laughs> just the way it was? Exactly the way it was. And believe me, I'll know. Now get to work! Darkstalkers 